Hello Berries, so I'm here with the chicken and little Olive and you guys haven't met her before but she's just come back from summer camp and this is my kid, Olive and it's short for Olivia, we just call her Olive, it's like her little nickname and Richard's just moved into this house so this is the first time she's actually seen it as well so this is new to her, a new neighbourhood and stuff so she's excited to look about but she is very shy so she won't speak that much because she is shy Like mother, like daughter just like me, yes, I'm shy too. But look, she's my little meanie me. How cute is she? Yeah, it's so cute. Say hi, Olive. Hello. Hmm. Amber, we're sort of lacking in the food department. I don't know what we're going to do for dinner tonight. Oh, no. Sort of running low on the old groceries. I want to make spaghetti bolognese tonight. Yeah, we don't have spaghetti and we don't have the sauce or the onions. So no spaghetti, no bolognese. No spaghetti. Absolutely zero bolognese. Bolognese. No. None <sighs> of okay, well, I guess we can just pop down to the grocery store. How about you just take Olive and I'll stay here and I'll clean up a little bit then. Okay, okay. Olive, do you want to come with me to the grocery store? She's obsessed with this show at the moment. It's her favourite show. She can just sit there and watch it for hours. Oh, she's getting a bit smelly, actually. She should go and have a, a quick bath, though. Okay, yeah, can we just go and have a bath first and then we can take you there after, yeah? Okay. Okay, good. Let's go. Come follow me. Right then, go on then. Jump in that. Yeah, make sure you, you wash your hair properly, please. She really loves bath time. Right, it's time to get out of the bath now. Come on, before the go. You've been in there for 30 minutes. Right, there we go. Put a towel around you. Now you're all nice and clean. Let me just spray some perfume on before I go. No, 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 you don't use that perfume. That's my perfume. It's very expensive. Are you guys going? Yeah, yeah, we're going now. So is there anything that you want specifically? Uh, don't forget the spaghetti and do not forget the bolognese. Okay, well, I guess they're on my list. You don't want any snacks or anything? Oh, maybe maybe some beans, not as a okay. snack. Beans? Oh, um, I love to snack on beans. I love just opening a cold can of beans. Mm. No, some crisps, please. I love crisps. And a banana, because fruits are very good. Yeah, we're going to get Olive a banana. Hey, what car do you want to take? Do you want to take the motorbike? Oh, I kicked I kicked your car out. So you're gonna, yeah, you're going to have to take one of my good, good cars. What do you hey? mean you kicked my car out? You didn't park it well. Oh. It was fully parked. Wow. Okay, well, let's take this one, because Richard's car is too fast. Do you want to come open the door for you so you don't have to get out? Yes, please. There you go. All right, drive safe. See you soon. Thank you. Try and drive very carefully because normally I'm a bit of a lunatic sometimes on these roads, but yeah, so I've got to get spaghetti bolognese, um, an apple, banana. Here we are. Let me just park this up. Oops, oops. Get perfect parking. Right, there we go. Coming out. Right. Let's see. So, oh, there's a big line in here though. Are we ever going to get served? No, you can't be, you can't work in there, I'm afraid. Oh, oh, okay, well. And he's like, hey, we just get out of there. I used to work here, actually. It was my first job in Bloxburg, and I was very bad. I kept clicking on everything instead of pressing E. Very, and then I got fired after that. Let's see, let's get a trolley first. Or a shopping cart. Okay, so yeah, if you want some beans. Thank you, pointing those out. Canned beans, put those in. Some crisps. And a banana. Hmm. Let's get you an apple. Some grapes as well. Whilst we're here, let's get some grapes. We do need some drinks as well, so I'll buy a few of those. Cheese. They tempt us with this cheese. Because the cheese is there, and you know I love cheese. But we can't get it. You just can't grab it. So what's the cheese doing there? If you can't buy it, people, I want the cheese. Yeah, and the watermelon too. I want the watermelon. But you cannot have it. Okay, I've already put the spaghetti, spaghetti in. Let's just load this into the back of the car then. And I think I got the bolognese actually. Did I get the bolognese? No, I did. Okay. There you go. So we'll put it in the back. Let's go back and cook you and we're chicken a beautiful meal. Oh, by the way, Olive, I love your hair. She likes to have the exact same things as me. She likes wearing the same clothes as me. She likes having the same hairstyle as me. She's at that age where they just like to copy what you wear and stuff, which is really cute. 
And I think she looks adorable with it. And she's so tiny. She can barely look over. Someone is out there. Someone I open this. He's gonna run in. There's a man out here, Rich. Be careful. He's trying to get in. I see him. I see him. Excuse me, sir. Ki the there's a kid in the only. car. Kid in the car. Quick, get in. Okay, hold on. I'm parking up. Amber, you're looking very run down. Oh, I'm so tired. You know shopping's tiring. I'm carrying those bags as well. Can you help me with the groceries and take that inside, please? Yes, of course. Since you're very tired. Olive doesn't look tired, though. It's no, well, she wasn't the one pushing the trolley about, was she? Oh, I guess so. Right, let me just put these inside here. It's like a fridge. And then I can get making food. Olive, if you want, we can go put your favourite show on and you can uh, sit here for a little bit. There you go. Yuppie. <laughs> I'm just going to put Aww. on the food then. Actually, do you know what? I might have to sit down for a little bit. Yeah, Amber, how about since you went to the grocery store and stuff, I'll make food. Okay. My treat for you and Olive today. All right, what are we making? Hmm. Turkey, cake. You cannot make turkey or cake. So... Spaghetti bolognese, which I can't make. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not level five, I'm afraid. What, you can't make spaghetti? No, I can't make it, I'm afraid. You're going to have to make it. All right, can you sit in there and watch her, please, then? Yes, I will do the hard job of sitting down and watching TV. Right, I'm just going to get making a spaghetti bolognese. So first of all, I'm going to season it and form the meatballs. Roll them up into little balls. And I'm going to fry them a bit. I'm going to brown the meatballs for a bit before we do anything else. Season it with a bit of salt. I'm trying to give Rich a little lesson, but he just cares about watching that instead. But, you know. Sorry, you, you, did you mention me, huh? Uh, what was that? Never mind. Yes. Yeah, I'm, I'm just watching Unicorn. Yeah, okay. And let's boil the spaghetti. Normally, I would do this at the same time as cooking the meatballs and then I'm waiting. But, you know, it doesn't take that long to cook the pasta, so. How's it going in here? How's it looking? It's smelling nice. Smelling very nice. We can't wait for dinner. Why don't you put some um, drinks out on the t dining table for us? Yeah, good idea, good idea. Did you get drinks from the shop? Yeah, I did. I got some boxy colas and stuff like that in the fridge. Not for Olive, though, because Olive's not allowed to drink that. No, 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 I've, I know. She's not allowed. Olive, dinner's ready, so can you go into the dining room, please? I'm just going to be making a bit of the um, salad in the dining room. The spaghetti's already in there, so you can put a plate in front of you. But don't eat before, because we have to say thank you, okay? All right, do you want me to say thanks? Yes, please. Okay, thank you to Rachikin for creating this lovely meal. Thank you to Unicorn for the endless hours of entertainment. And thank you to Amber for, for going to fetch all of the bolognese and all of the spaghetti. Amen. And thank you to Olive for being very well behaved today. Yes, you've been very well behaved today. But she's been no problem. She was really good with me at the grocery store. Oh, that's nice to hear. Back from summer camp. Right, as soon as you've been such a good girl, how would you like it, because it's oh, after dinner, if we go and get you some ice cream? Yeah! We can take this car. I'll just make sure I drive really slow. Oh, let me come and open the garage door for you. Hold on. Did I just hear a crash in there? Did you just crash into the, the door? No. No. No, I did not. Thank you. Okay, see you later. Bye. See Bye, ya. Olive. Oh, it's got quite dark now. Now it's no longer summer. It gets darker a bit earlier, see? Oh, I took the wrong turn in. Ignore that. This is where your Aunt Feebery works sometimes when she needs extra cash. Yeah, Aunt feebery has got like a new job as well. She's got like a laundrette and stuff like that and a diner. So I'll take you to that soon if you want to go to that. Right. Yes. Can I have one ice cream, please? What would you like? What ice cream? Chocolate ice cream, vanilla or strawberry. Right. There's your strawberry ice cream. I'm going to get a chocolate ice cream. You're welcome. Here we are finally. Sorry, it's really late. I've got to put you to bed straight away. I'm going to have a bath after. Someone's calling oh, your name. I hear them. I hear them. I'm going to open the garage door for you. Olive, do you have a mum or dad? He's trying to steal our child. Oh. There's a man outside calling Olive's name because they want her to adopt her instead. Yes, she does have a, a family. Whoa, she's smelly again. How, how do we get so stinky? Yeah. Olive, you should go to the downstairs bathroom. Right okay, now. well, can you check on her then, please? Can you yes, give her a bath again and the downstairs one? I'm going to go upstairs and win this one. This one's got a TV, so I'm going to turn it over to Unicorn. Oh, she's had too much Unicorn, Rich. No, she deserves it. She had a long day, Amber, a long day. Okay, now, Missy, it's time for bed. You've been staying up way too late lately, and school is going to be starting soon. Olive actually is actually starting school soon. She is going into reception, so she was going to nursery before. 
and now she's gonna be going into reception so it's a big change so big girl school soon so it's gonna be her first day in a couple of days so that means you've got to get into a better routine because you've been staying up too late during the summertime which is kind of my fault but yeah let's go shall we put you to bed right so she's been staying in this room upstairs which isn't going to be her official room but it's just that it's a spare room for now so we're going to be decorating this room soon and making it for what she wants because i don't think she likes the dark colors in here she wants it to be a bit more bright and vibrant don't you put your nice pjs on i'll go and wash your clothes downstairs after oh you want a pink room yeah we can do that we'll have to go and get some paint for that oh they're cute little ones they knew oh they're nice okay well hop into bed please we turn these candles off that's very dangerous next to your bed we're going to be getting rid of the candles in here because that is not very safe for a young lady uh, let's turn the light off where is the switch in here do i even put the I put a switch there we're gonna to have to put a switch in here too excuse me i was trying to, off. Help. Oh. Was trying to help oh okay well say good night to her good night olive good night olive she's asleep already be quiet yeah she's fell asleep really really quick it's because we've been out all day and doing stuff yeah. You are a long time. Long yeah. Time. Well, that was just a nice, simple day. It's actually nice. It wasn't too hectic because, you know, she just come back from camp and, and things. We're actually going to have a lot of things to do, though. We have to decorate her room soon. And her first day of school is going to be coming up soon as well. So a lot of things with Olive. And we've got to take the show, uh, show Phoebe's play. So the Amber oh, yeah. Hotel. The best thing about Phoebe now being in here is that she can babysit Olive sometimes if we ever do need a babysitter. So that is really handy. But yes, I hope you guys liked it and enjoyed meeting little Olive. And I will see you guys next time. Bye. Bye, everyone. Goodbye.